ni post picha na major uh, was it like a small clip kama naweza kumbuka eh, vitu tu watu wanaanza kuongea wale watasema ah major lazima na nini <laughs> yeah has it ever crossed your mind <laughs> eh nilikuwa na eh nilikuwa nime tense mbaya naomba eh and this was i think a year after tunaongeanga tu tunapigana tu simu nini major ni alini alini julia kutoka sirudi home the original and this one time i think ali play kwa ig live yake yeah. kama unaweza leo tuna kesha pass me another kama weza. inakuwa je watu wangu nguvu mimi naitwa presenter ali yo at 7 pm by the way the a is always for amazing siku zote natia bidii kuhakikisha kwamba nakuletea stories tofauti za burudani and of course this episode has been sponsored by hewa hewa is a wireless pocket audio ambayo unaweza kuconnect na simu yako and it goes for as low as 2000 kenya shillings cheki kwenye screen yako namba iko hapo just call us utaweza kujipatia hewa yako the good thing about hewa ni kwamba if you buy two you get one free hakikisha uh, kwamba unashikana na washikaji zako watatu mnachangia mbili alafu mnapata moja extra anyways leo nimekuja kupiga story na msanii ambaye anafanya vizuri sana msanii ambaye anakimbiza sana kabaya ama ukipenda muite mandi mambo mpwa sana fresh kwa salama good to see you it's good to see you too yeah last time tumeonana ilikuwa december na yeah. 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 yeah na uliua kwenye show sana kaida mambo yangu uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah. unajitaga kabaya kabaya is your name ah uh, kabaya ni alter ego tu uh, ni ya kujibandikia uh, wewe yeah. ulijita kabaya mimi nilijita kabaya mimi kale kale mkabaya ni alafu is manzi wa Nairobi part of your tagline ama signature um it used yeah. to be yeah i feel like nilijita nili manzi wa Nairobi kwa sababu through my music like na, na share experiences zangu as a young woman living in Nairobi capital city of Kenya yeah. an East African girl yeah. so niko na wacha ni embody to your gene ju yeah. dunia mzima kuna manzika wa Nairobi yeah. <laughs> leo nikiamka by the way nilijua anakuja kufanya interview na Mandi nikamwe leo nataka tu nisikize ngoma zako one of the songs yenye yani mimi upenda yako inaitwa by the way by the way ile yako tumio na x-ray yeah. yeah it's a good vibe and looking at you the way ume grow uh, from me time ni kujue mara kwanza kujua mandi by the way ulikuwa dj eh mbona unacheka ni vile tu sijashika mashini for a long time but me nilikuwa dj nilikuwa dj for like two years very serious one kwa ninapata like my job nini nini but niko na acha ni opt for music juu pia nilikuwa shule ikakuwa bit hectic kujuggle kila kitu na sijai regret choice yangu yeah how did you transition from the dj part to the music part because ulikuwa sengine unaenda uko studio ni tu gigs za dj how was it ndio nasema ilikuwa hectic especially vile nikaenda saa ku join university niko na sasa one has to go na siezi enda niambie mzae ati ya sitaki shule hiyo ingekuwa shida so nika decide acha nifanye music because it was a bit easier for me um, the hours are much better um, eh hey, niko na tu acha nifanye muziki na ni kitu ilikuwa na naturally kwang like kuandika muziki si ngumu kwangu kitu na take maximum 10 minutes so niko na wacha tu niende na muziki instead yeah. Yeah. yeah looking at what you're doing and what other artists are doing what do you think makes you stand out mimi ni mrembo um i think me vile nezaona na si ati kujigamba anything i feel like kenya has experience msani kama mimi for a very long time na mimi niko all rounded my music is good my beat selection is good my writing ni mzuri mimi ni performing artist umeniona kwa stage yes. na hakuna msi anaweza anaweza kuza sema ati oh mandi vako yako ume copy kutoka huyu 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 hapana like mimi ni original sana yeah. and i'll probably be kenya's best export esh, esh. <laughs> i read somewhere kwamba mandi terms herself as the female version of isa Yeah um it was when was it that was a song i did in 2018 yeah. i think um mi upenda isa sana and life ni funny sana because right now i'm i'm, I'm i work very closely with ogopa 
Okay. So okay. like ina feel like I could say kwa tu manifestation in a way. Like a reincarnation. <laughs> yeah. Awe, unataka ni roast you as I just appreciate his music. Na kitu ilikuwa ina ni fascinate na yeye ni alikuwa rapper mnoma, writer mnoma, lakini bado ana make muziki yenye wa Kenya wote wanaweza sikia. Si ati ni ni hip hop ama trap deep ama nini, but like ni kitu inclusive na ni kitu nostalgic sana. So mimi kwa very fascinated na style yake. So eh si ati nilikuwa nasema literally I am as just appreciating who he was as an artist yeah we've seen many you know artists who come uh, kwa game that is both male and female and one has try so much to get some collabs and so to you inonekana kwamba hey zina come easy how how do you manage to get some of these you know to collabs because msia kwa like eh mande amepiga collab na umse kidogo kidogo na umse in ikwaje mimi sema ni ni god first of all ni god juu vitu zingine hata mimi hivyo vile unashanga pia mimi nashanga lakini um i think watu tu wanapenda work ethic yangu na wanapenda muziki yangu na ni very easy for me to blend in na so many of these artists eh kama kina x-ray kina brida major nini like style yangu inaweza inaweza change change ndio mm-hmm. ifit wa our to what and i accommodate but other than that naweza sema tu ni it good to yeah. yeah yeah we were having this conversation with you yeah. you know of camera and we were talking about if you really think kwamba right now we are in an age in msia naweza kusema you know muziki inalipa mm-hmm. you've been in the game for a while mm-hmm. and you've seen tem maybe ulikuwa dj umeona wasanii wana hit lakini hawana do mm-hmm. what do you think has changed th- right now yenye unapata msia kwa na hit moja na anaweza make some money out of it naweza sema first of all um e digital era yenye tunaishi ime make like ime kata job in half yeah. Jum se kama mimi I think nilianza muziki 2016. Mm-hmm. Na 2019 mm-hmm. nilikuwa ninafanya most of my promo online. Yeah. Una get mm-hmm. like YouTube, Instagram, Twitter through referrals. Yeah. I think even one of my songs in it was national lip gloss mm-hmm. ili blow up on Twitter. Yeah. Una get. Mm-hmm. So like ime imefanya kazi ya msanii kwa rais. I don't have to nieke wimbo kwa flash atinipeleke radio ama tv ndio ichezwe yeah. ifanywe nini hapana ninaweza naweza fanya tu hiyo kazi yote online na hiyo online pina ina create a sense of like unaweza kuinteract na watu wanapenda mziki yako na hiyo ni one of the things me appreciate sana so i'd say sai it's a very easy for an artist kujulikana than it was kitambo yeah wow Mandi ni ni ni, ni msanii ni msani, watu wanamjua pengine alikuwa DJ but people mm. really don't know you know the other side of Mandi. Mandi ni mtu aina gani? Wewe ni mtu ambaye unakuwa outgoing, mm. unakuwa unapenda sherehe kama venye unaimbaga <laughs> ama wewe ni mtu mwenye uko chilled, au uh, unashindaga indoors, wewe ni mtu aina gani? I think we need like in between mm-hmm. uh, but me ni mshai watu wa jangi ni mshai mm-hmm. like in real life ukipata na mimi uko nje mm-hmm. watu most people who anafikiria ni maringo mm-hmm. but na kuanga na inaitwa social anxiety like jangi <laughs> yeah. kuongelesha watu vizuri mm-hmm. but other than that mimi napenda sherehe sana sana mimi so, na sherehe tuko okay, hivi okay. <laughs> so would you say una imbaga life yako at some point yeah mimi uimba kila kitu yenye mimi usema hata usikize wimbo gani hata niseme nini hiyo ni kitu hiyo <laughs> ni kitu idha nimefanya ama nimeona ikifanyika okay. eh hey. na hata hata big percentage ni zenye umefanya ama ni zenye umeona <laughs> Acha nisijichome acha niseme ni zenye nimeona. Ndio tusichome. Acha nisichome. Tusichome leo labda siku nyingine lakini si leo. Bing wakati ambapo ulikuwa unakuwa msanii ambaye ni upcoming. Was there a female artist ulikuwa anasumbua sana Kenya unasema eh nataka hiyo spot. Natamani not kuitaka natamani kuwa kwa hiyo spot. I mean I not really. I think um up to time Nadia alikuza ka blow up there wasn't really much you could go by yeah. or compare with mm-hmm. but sasa unaona mse kama Nadia at least ali alieka like preset ya after this do this this is how you move this is how mm-hmm. una unaongea unafanya nini but before that 
I don't I don't think unless sasa nifikirie kabisa but hakuna mm-hmm. msiati nilikuwa naona nasema wa mimi naweza taka kufika hapo pia yeah and right now looking at the industry personally naona kwamba tumefika ile time yenye ukita ukita msanii wa Kenya mm-hmm. you don't have to say male artist you don't have to yeah. say female artist because yeah. right now naona wasanii wa kike mm-hmm. wana to represent vizuri okay. we are having Mandy we are having uh, Saru mm-hmm. we are having Nadia yani wako all over uh, do you feel it's an advantage for you or it's a challenge because yeah. initially ilikuwa msanii uh, a female artist was so like eh huyu dem ni mkali <laughs> yeah. but right now you're being even compared with you know okay, yeah. mm-hmm. do you feel it's a good thing or it's a challenge i feel it's a good thing mm-hmm. kwa sababu pia inani push kwa bigger and better yeah. unaona yeah. like si semi at sasa tunakuwa categorize at madem nyinyi pamba neni wanaume wako kando z ina inatupia pia drive ya kuonyesha we are just as good as better as more determined as talented as the male artists mm-hmm. so misi oni kani shida honestly plus sani ni kubwa yeah. ni kubwa sana we can all eat so mi hiyo kitu ya kushindana na sijui dem sijui nini hizo na ngatu ni waste time eh. okay right now umeachia ngoma inaitwa kau na weza umefanya na meja hebu tupigie ka freestyle kauna weza leo tuna kesha pass me another kauna weza hiyo imetosha waende youtube waende youtube link pale kwenye comment section yeah. and i'm going to pin it show some love show some support usikize hiyo ngoma by the way ni noma sana but i just want to know how did this collab come to be because kwanza kufanya collab na major lazima akupende that's one thing i noticed yeah. ati major unaweza kuwe ni mkali lakini asikizaji ngoma zako ama hajapenda hiyo vibe mm. na kunyime collab yeah. so this means kwamba alipenda hii first of all as asema tena ni god hajadi <laughs> mimi mpaka sasa hii hata video kwa youtube sielewi na siezi explain but major ni alini alini julia kutoka sirudi home the original and this one time i think ali play kwa ig live yake then one of my friends akanikola akaniambia yo major is playing your song mm-hmm. kwa IG live and I was nikashanga nikatafuta mm-hmm. namba yake haraka haraka nikam call kumwambia manze shukran mi ata intention yangu iko ati kuimba na ye, mm-hmm. but yeah. ni very yani major ni mse muskiza sana na nimemsikiza for the longest time na mi admire style yake so even before sikuwa na expect at nitafika place nimbe na yeye mi bora tu ana exist na naweza sikiza wimbo zake yeah. naweza furahi yeah. and one of the things na napenda na kumhusu mm-hmm. ni mse yani intentional yani yako na roho tu safi mm-hmm. na bora vibe imekubali yako hapo yeah. so this song um nilimtumia actually i sent to and i told him you chagwenyu yeah. na nilikuwa naogopa nilikuwa na rafiki yangu unafikiria atakwambia uko na zingine <laughs> at nizi tu yeah. 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 nilikuwa na eh yeah. nilikuwa ni metens mbaya anamwambia yeah. and this was i think a year after tunaongeanga tu tunapigana tu simu yeah. nini nini na nikasema kitu tu ikaniambia this is the right time acha nimtumie yeah. eh nauliza bist yangu sana akikata <laughs> <laughs> Tafaya nini yeah. but akaku, akaipenda mm-hmm. akaniambia nipatie tu wiki mm-hmm. tuende studio mm-hmm. sasa mimi si kwa shule time nilikuwa mshawe commit ama mko mnongea uh, tu kwa simu because we meet once mm-hmm. kwa remix ya one of the songs he was on also oh, i can't remember what song it was but we had met only once yeah. kaniambia wewe nipe tu wiki sasa sivi nikafikiria ni ile kipindi tu eh yeah, ah. ni sawa yeah. so ikafika nikapigia hiyo wimbo kwanza alikuwa nimefanya na Rico Beats yes. eh shout out kwake tuko na mangoma mingi sana tumefanya na yeye eh. na tukaenda studio na ngoma ikakuwa na tukafanya video what, what are some of the things zenye unakumbuka zili happen you know pale studio zenye uko like eh hizi vitu zina ni, ni vizuri watu wajue ama the, ni notable to experiences <laughs> kuna part fulani kwa hiyo wimbo yeah. meza anasema nikimaliza si uta splash <laughs> eh hey, nilikuwa ninaisha ilibidi hadi ameniambia tu nitoke studio kwanza Olai. yani hiyo kitu ilikuwa funny je unashangaa yani akili yako tu imeketi hivi uh-huh. ikasema acha niandike splash Imagine. sasa kuongeza 
akaeka mona hapo nikamwambia ah si yake pia mimi eh, tukaeka moe eh, kitu bado ni funny nikisikiza hiyo wimbo it's yeah, still very funny very, to me funny. yeah how was the you know how was shooting of the video ilikuwa je shoot ilikuwa poa nilifanya video na big dreams that's Ricky Beko na ni mse pia nimekuwa nikitamani kwa kuna i think for four years now tangu ni kwa rapa mm-hmm. so nina same hizi vitu zote tu mm-hmm. yani sisi hata understand but yeah. eh, we did a shoot ilikuwa overnight ilikuwa poa team poa yani it, it was a very smooth video mm-hmm. shoot hata sina sina anything to say about yeah. it yeah what makes this uh, shoot different than zenye umekuwa kifanya yenye una feel like eh last video siku mm. fanya hivi but this time nime upgrade kidogo Wanze nili dance. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Nilikuwa na umana magoti the next day. I did the choreography by Ade. Yeah. Na niliona tu acha ni spice up juu. Si kitu tumezoea kuona sana. Nikaamua yeah, yeah. acha tu nijiue ni. Kwenda di kwa sakafu, magoti yeah. bado nimegwaruza. Yeah. Nimegwaruza magoti mpaka wa leo. Siezi siezi nil. Yeah, people really don't understand the struggle. Hiyo nayo ni struggle, but ilikuwa fun sana. Na niliona hiyo end product, nikasema I made a very good decision to dance, yeah. The first time we post picture na major, uh was it a small clip kama naweza kumbuka. I think vitu tu watu wanza kuongea. You understand like ah ni collabo then kuna wale watasema ah meja lazima na nini <laughs> <laughs> yeah has it ever crossed your mind you know like you and meja ewe when kumboka we are I'm working i don't know it, it has not mm-hmm. i see him more as uh, not a, fa- a father figure like msetu nikiwa na shida pia mimi mpigia na ni guide na nipe advice because he's a very wise person very very wise mm-hmm. but mambo na romancing i see i hata yeye hajawahi ai hajawahi si ndio ninakwambia like ni msetu pure like i think he's one of the very few male artists nime meet na yeye yani angali kama atidem yana niangalia kama creative to eh creative i'm just as talented na ni msi tunaweza fanya kazi na eh mm-hmm. na this won't be the first song tunafanya na eh very many 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 other songs to yeah. come eh yeah. yeah. lakini hawa sani umesema is among the few artists kwa hiyo kuna wengine wana wanasumbua sana hey, umeniona kweli acha mimi ninge <laughs> sisi walaumu in fact <laughs> ninaweza shangaa sana kwa kiwazo <laughs> The fact that you are young kama wewe na hawaoni una shanga sana. Yeah. But I don't blame them. Mm-hmm. Hata mimi nikijiangalia kwa kiosa zina na semanga tu. Wa. Mm-hmm. Kwa nini wewe? <laughs> e, e, are you are you dating? No. Why? I don't feel like. You don't feel like dating. Yeah. You just want to concentrate on work. To have fun. Ama ulipigwa ile kitu na Nairobi mm-hmm. character mm-hmm. develop. Mimi eh. siwezi. Unaweza fanywa Nairobi tumeishi miaka mingi sana. Siwezi. How, how 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 sure are you ah, because there's a time nilikuona na nilikuona Nairobi gossip eh? mm. na mse flani alikuwa ni nani mm. yeah nani ilikuwa video it was a video mm. okay ilikuwa video mm. so how you don't date <laughs> you don't date or you don't feel like I dating don't, yeah. I, i don't say maybe there's three or four people out there who can attest otherwise mm-hmm. but three or four i don't you mean fun as what how do you mean three or four in this lifetime uh, okay. she oh. said me is eh yali i'm sorry i'm sorry yeah okay but <laughs> but eh nataka tu ni ni enjoy life ni make tu muziki mm You want to make music first? Eh? I just want to make money and music. Okay. Tukimalizia tu. What do you want to be remembered for? Unataka yani in the in the next few years dinamandi kitajwa nini kuje kwa kilia watu? I just want to be a part of people's journeys. 
like mse tu aseme manze nikiwa uni wimbo tulikuwa tunaisikiza you know like just yeah i just want to be a part of their lives and their journeys and i want to be the one to break easy barriers zote zenye tumekewa as a kenyan industry yeah. and as kenyan artists eh nataka tu nikumbuku hivyo yeah amazing me i really appreciate you for what you're doing i know you're doing an amazing job na najua in the next uh, you know not in the next few years in the next few months actually tunaanza next, ku- next month tuna- <laughs> uh, because for me Uh, what i'm going to tell you yeah. i don't know come out and yamini because i know this collab is going to open doors zenye ujawai kuona you know for you and you're doing an amazing job keep pushing you know usi give up i know you you can never do that i can never give yeah. up you so, will see me around for a very long time amazing. yeah, yeah. ongea na mashabiki zako hi guys this is mandy aka kabaya aka wife material aka manzi wa nairobi mm-hmm. and nimetoa video and it's a counter always a featuring major kuonko the one and only chairman um iko channel yangu uh, on mandy that's m w a n d y you can watch the video there and it's also on all streaming platforms just search for mandy m w a n d y Oh. Amazing sana. Mimi ni representer Ali, your entertainment PA just reminding you kwamba the episode has been sponsored by Hewa. It's a uh, it's called Hewa Pocket Wireless Audio ambayo unaweza kuconnect na simu yako. And let me give you another interesting fact about Hewa. If you buy two, apart from the fact that utopewa one free is that you can you can connect two Hewas zinaimba at the same time. How cool is that? Anyways, behind the camera ni mwanangu nguvu anaitwa director captain tuko na Jorizo. Yuko kwenye lighting alafu mimi ni representer Ali, your entertainment PA. The A is always for amazing. Siku zote ukitaka kufanikiwa usipende kusifiwa. I'll see you guys in the next video.